Welcome to the Mercy College School of Education 2021 Commencement Ceremony. I'm Eric Martone, Interim Dean of the School of Education. As we started this academic year, with our world racked by a global pandemic and much uncertainty, all I could think about was one four-letter word, hope. Hope to stay healthy, hope for a vaccine, hope for a better world, hope for a brighter future, hope to find new solutions to still serve our education candidates. You may have held some similar hopes, including the hope to make it here today, to the finish line of the academic work you started here at Mercy College. To paraphrase a line in a famous 20th century Sicilian novel, everything needs to change in order for things to remain the same. This past academic year at Mercy, everything seemed to change, such as reduced room capacities and social distancing in classrooms, increased hand sanitizing stations, COVID screening questionnaires to come on campus, and other health and safety protocols, as well as new distance learning modalities. But these changes allowed things to stay the same. Mercy remains steadfast in its mission and principles. School of Education candidates continue to learn and move forward in their professional aspirations. And more importantly, that sense of pride in one's accomplishments that you have achieved through your resiliency continues to reverberate through our celebrations today. Students like you help us remember why we entered the field of education in the first place inspire us to continually strive to be better teachers and leaders ourselves. I and the faculty and staff of the School of Education would like to congratulate the class of 2021 and wish you much success on all your future endeavors. We are extremely proud of you and welcome you into the Mercy Alumni community. Good afternoon to all and thank you for joining us. My name is Dana Esposito. Today I have the honor of addressing you as the student speaker for the School of Education. Merriam-Webster provides one definition of mercy as a fortunate circumstance. How apt that I should be asked about my path to mercy when really it was mercy in itself that brought me here. My mother graduated from this institution 43 years ago. That I would end up coming here as well was unplanned but beautiful because there are no footsteps better to follow than hers. After receiving my undergraduate degree, I experienced a series of fortunate circumstances that eventually led me to pursue a degree in teaching. Mercy had a program where I could receive dual certification, so there I went. Through Mercy, I was not only able to get a master's degree in early elementary education, but four certifications as well, including two in special education. After I finished my degree, I came back for advanced certification in literacy. I became a special education teacher. Then I came back for a master's in educational leadership. Again, Mercy had the exact program I wanted. I will be graduating today with dual certification in school building leadership and school district leadership. The past year has been difficult for everyone. Graduates, your attendance here today means so much more than a degree. It means you were able to navigate the waters of this world not only without sinking, but by eventually getting to dry land. Your certification is a flag that should be flown wherever you go because you earned it. Through dark times, you carried your own torch. Congratulations. Thank you to the people who stood by us, believed in us, and encouraged us as we progressed on our academic journeys. Thank you to the faculty who understood how hard balancing school with life can be and gave us grace while supporting us in the virtual world. Thank you to Mercy College for ensuring that we received a ceremony, one way or another. You are all here to make changes, to educate, to create, to inspire. May this day be the beginning of something brighter than you could have ever imagined. As for me, I will not be stopping here. There is much yet to be done. I wish the same for you all as I do for myself. May we continue to grow and learn, continue to make real differences in the lives of those around us, stand up for what is truly important and help empower a new generation to follow. May we all forever be blessed enough to walk the path of mercy. Thank you. And now the president of Mercy College, Tim Hall. I will now present the honorary degree to Andrea Caudet. Andrea Caudet, you have a long-standing career as an exceptional administrator, ensuring that youth aspire to their highest potential. 
In your former role as Assistant Superintendent of the Yonkers Public School District, you oversaw the Division of Teaching and Learning, ensuring that all curricula aligned to the New York State Learning Standards so that students were prepared for college and for their careers. During your time as Chairperson of the Yonkers Basics Advisory Board, you led a team of volunteers charged with helping the Yonkers community address cognitive and social-emotional inequities due to poverty. Your leadership in education includes previous positions as the Assistant Superintendent for K-12 Instruction in the East Ramapo Central School District, as well as Supervisor of Secondary Special Education at Nyack Public Schools. You began your career in education as a special education teacher and a mathematics specialist, worked as an early childhood principal, a K-5 principal, and as a secondary special education director. As the Chief Executive Officer at Empowered for Learning, you lead an education leadership consulting firm to advise school and district personnel, parent groups, institutions of higher education, and community groups on organizational best practices. Having lived in and been educated in four countries on three continents, you are truly a global citizen. After earning your bachelor's degree in psychology from Mercy College in 1995, you went on to earn your master's degree in curriculum and instruction with a reading specialization and educational administration from Pace University and a doctorate in executive leadership from Fordham University. As a member of the School of Education Advisory Board at Mercy College, your contribution to your alma mater is plentiful and greatly esteemed. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the State of New York and by the Board of Trustees of Mercy College, I confer upon you, Andrea Caudet, the degree of Doctor of Humane Letters, honoris causa, with all rights and privileges thereto appertaining. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to introduce Dr. Andrea Caudet. Good day, Mercy College Mavericks. It is an honor to be here celebrating your graduation day. Thank you too, to the Mercy College School of Education, families, friends, colleagues, and guests for joining this auspicious occasion. I am Dr. Andrea Cadet, a 26 year Mercy College alumna, an adjunct professor at Mercy College, an educator for 29 years, a fierce advocate for children, a mentor for all drawn to the noble journey of educational leadership, and most importantly, the proud mother of a high school senior. Graduates, Congratulations. This is a well-deserved honor you have worked so hard for. An old African proverb says, it takes a village to raise a child. Here at Mercy College, we aspire to raise strong and successful educators like yourselves. People who can take their place in a global society alongside educators from different countries, cultures, religious beliefs, socioeconomic status, skills, and talents. I am humbled and profoundly grateful to be part of your village and to give the commencement address for the School of Education. Today, I will share with you what it means to dare to be a maverick. The Webster Dictionary defines a maverick as an independent individual who does not go along with a group or party. In these extraordinary times, we need extraordinary measures and extraordinary people. We need mavericks. So what does a maverick do? Prepare. As in the Leaning Tower of Pisa, an inadequate foundation and a soft ground can result in unintended tilt. Ensure your skills will enable you to manage and pivot in times of uncertainty and change. Learn. Businessman and author James Altucher said, everything in your life is your mentor. Think of everything you see and do as mentoring you. Therefore, 
Learn from every experience, whether positive or negative. Act with moral purpose. Your actions do speak louder than your words. People will judge you by what you do rather than by what you say. So make sure your practice reflects your beliefs. Network. Those you regularly interact with can ease your journey along the leadership continuum. If you want to lead, place yourself in professional situations that will further your growth. Use social media to achieve your goals so a prospective employer who reads your posts will be able to determine whether you are a good fit for their organization. Decide or share a decision. President John F. Kennedy once said, the president must know when to lead the Congress, when to consult it, and when he should act alone. You have to develop the ability to make executive and share decisions and know when to exercise either choice. Enjoy. More than anything, enjoy what you do. Joy enhances the freedom to take risks and grow. Without it, it is hard to make a positive change. Steve Jobs, the founder of Apple shared, I have looked in the mirror every morning and asked myself, if today were the last day of my life, would I want to do what I'm about to do today? And whenever the answer has been no for too many days in a row, I know I need to change something. With so much turmoil facing our nation and world today, whether due to the COVID-19 epidemic, demonstrations against police brutality, instances of institutional racism and sexism or abuses of power, you may wonder how to focus on the next stage of your life. How will you dare to be a maverick when today seems so uncertain? My words of wisdom are as follows. A maverick dares to be extraordinary, not ordinary. A maverick dares to stand up and stand out, not merely fit in. A maverick dares to make excellence their standard. A maverick dares to disrupt the status quo if it does not contribute to their success or the success of others. A maverick dares to reach far beyond what they or anyone else believes to be their capacity. A maverick seeks to be a transformational rather than just a charismatic leader. So whatever your next journey may be, make sure you pack your best maverick attitude, your best maverick effort, your best maverick clothing, and yes, your best maverick family and friends because you will need them. Mercy College, class of 2021. Congratulations once again on your achievements. May you be richly blessed as you enter the next phase of your life. Thank you once again for the honor to speak with you today. I leave you with the words of a traditional Gaelic blessing. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sunshine warm upon your face, the rains fall soft upon your fields, and until we meet again, may God hold you in the palm of his hand. Dare to be a maverick, go forth and change the world. Wanda Gibson, Ebony Gibson's mom. I am so proud of you and all your accomplishments. Through the hard times that you had, through each and every moment that it was a struggle for you to get to this point. I am so proud, so happy that you become this great teacher and continue to be blessed 
in all your journey. I love you and congratulations, my daughter. Yes. <laughs> love you. Congratulations to the class of 2021. I'm Dr. Eileen Rothschild from the School of Education. What is my wish for the graduates? That your dreams take you to the corners of your smiles, to the highest of your hopes, to the windows of your opportunities, and to the most special places your heart has ever known. Best of luck, Class of 2021, in all your future endeavors. Hello, Class of 2021, Dr. Marrero here. Just wanted to say congratulations and all the best to you. You have done an amazing job in terrible circumstances and you have persevered and gotten it done. So all the best, enjoy the day, enjoy a little celebration, and don't forget to keep in touch with all of us. Congrats. Congratulations, Jessica. I'm so proud of you and getting your master's from Mercy College. Uh, you worked so hard during this pandemic. Uh, as a single parent, teaching, and taking care of your little five-year-old Lucas. And I'm so proud of you. Love you. Bye-bye. Hi, graduates. My name is Patrick McCabe, and I'm with the School of Education. Maybe some of you know me. Maybe you have been in my class. And in any case, I want to congratulate you on this auspicious day in your life. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. So enjoy the moment, really, really enjoy it and relish it for, for your memories. Um, after this, you should probably have a socially distant party, have a nice time um, and, and be safe. And hopefully you'll be returning to Mercy uh, to get a graduate degree or just to come back and visit us. So congratulations as you go forward in life. Excellent, good job, you should be we're all proud of you, and most importantly, you should be proud of yourself. Hi, Mommy. Um, your graduation is in May 19. Um, I'm going to come see you, and I'm going to bring you flowers. And congratulations. I love you. Bye. Dear graduates, congratulations to you and your families. Your hard work over the last several years has paid off and you have paved the way to be effective leaders in your classrooms and advocates for your students. Please know that you will always be a part of the Mercy College family. We are excited to be your colleagues and partners in education. Again, our heartfelt congratulations. Hi, I'm Dr. Rose Rudnitsky, and I teach in the Educational Leadership Program with Dr. Koopmans, my partner here. And uh, we want to congratulate all of our educational leadership graduates. First of all, you're going to be leaders who make change in schools and bring justice and equality to our country. And we're very proud of you. And we want to make sure you stay in touch with us. We also want to congratulate all Mercy College graduates. You've accomplished a great deal and we're very proud of you too. Now, Dr. Koopmans. I would like to join Dr. Rose in, um, in giving you our, con our heartfelt congratulations. Um, you've done a great and terrific job, and we're very proud of you. Um, as for you, educational leaders, uh, we, believe, we believe that you can make a difference um, in the future, and we look forward to staying in touch and seeing your accomplishments in the field. And um, I also add my congratulations to all other, other Mercy, Mercy College graduates. You should be proud of yourselves. Good luck to all of you. Thanks. And now our graduates from the School of Education. Teresa Alberti. Alexa Alunji. Harriet Andrews. Teresa Amelda Andrews. Sylvia G. Anglin. Jessica Lauren Arroyo. Manal S. Ayad. With distinction. Sharika D. Bailey. Arnell Banks. Tara M. Bargolini. Lakeisha Barnett. 
Olivia L. Bate, with distinction. Martin J. Bauer. Victoria Bennett. John Carlos Benras. Taylor M. Bensaya, with distinction. Diana Berrios. Amber Lynette Blackwell. Francesca Bonfiglio. Clary I. Bonville. Valerie L. Basha. Megan Boyle. Olga L. Bravo. Osley Brickhouse. Kami Ash Brown, with distinction. Catherine Emma Broody. Jennifer M. Bruno. LaShonda Burnett. Andrea M. Cadena. Dana Calderero. Joseph P. Calderella. Kenya Jasmine Calixto Bravo. Melissa V. Capozella. Susie Carpenter. Kelly Cassius, with distinction. Lori Ann Catalano. Ingrid Ceballos. Lauren Cesera. Rachel L. Cesera. Julia Serbonne. Abigail Chatterpaul. Lindsay Chudova. Laura Clark. Catherine Clark. Melissa A. Cleveland. With distinction. Stephen L. Cohen. Christina Colon. Lourdes Colon. Patricia Conley. Bonaria Conti. Aislin R. Cornejo. Natalie E. Cotto, with distinction. Orville Crawford. Kimberly M. Crespin. Laura Ann Cruz. Angela Koranovic. Victoria L. D'Alessandro. Karen Darrell. Kimberly Davis Smith. Crystal De Leon. Carlanis De Los Santos. Danielle Desmond Ellis. Brianna Di Stefano. 
Crystal J. Diaz, with distinction. Wanda Diaz. Jackie DiMartino. Kayla R. Dustin. Jessica H. Edmund. Anisha Edwards. Samantha D. Eisenberg. Anthony Esposito. Dana L. Esposito. With distinction. Vincenzo Esposito. Shane Estrada. Christina M. Farrago. With distinction. Rachel Fazioli. Doris Feliciano. With distinction. Nicole Rose Ferrara. Danielle M. Ferrero. Penelope Angelique Ferreras. Maria Rosaria Figura. Courtney V. Flynn. Elizabeth Foyles. Kamisha Kamela Fonville. Rebecca L. Freeman Braun. With distinction. Allison Funicelli. Tatiana Jimena Galasso. Christine Gambino. Ariana Garcia. Vanessa Garcia Ruiz. Ebony L. Gibson. Kenneth William Joya. With distinction. Grace Giordano. Julia Gomez. With distinction. Aisha Venus Gomez. With distinction. Raina A. Gorman. Kelly Griffin. Casey K. Grisanti. Chaya M. Grossman. Jessica Rose Gurkha. BBF Gurmohamed. Iris A. Gutierrez. Andres I. Guzman. With distinction. Lessie Guzman. With distinction. Nicole Guzman. Tiffany Guzman. With distinction. Julissa Hartman. Tolga Hayali. Jillian K. Henderson. With distinction. Beverly G. Hickson. Shafan Hill. Lauren E. Holger. With distinction. Shayna Michelle Carolyn Hutchinson. Dana Iannacone. Dominique N. Jackson. LeVar H. James. Mary James. Jelmy Javier. Alicia M. Jean Latour. Tanvir Johal. With distinction. Asia C. Johnson. 
Keith A. Johnson. Tori Kerr, with distinction. Megan P. King. Tyler William Kroll. Daniela Lagani. Stacy A. Lugnes, with distinction. Suzanne M. Lampert. Donald Char Lapp. Allison K. Latainer, with distinction. Janelle Deidre Latouche, with distinction. Jacqueline Lee, with distinction. Jamie C. Leffert, with distinction. Christy Liberto. Ariel Jamas. Fallon N. Lloyd. Tyrone Lomas. Christina N. Lopez. Samantha Jean Lawrence. Janine J. Luke. Robert Machado. Navneet Mann. Pamela M. Manza. Amanda C. Marinato. Taylor Marshall. Thomas Mattarello. Miriam F. Marvin. Gina Massia. Erica J. Mason. With distinction. Joshua K. McClellan, with distinction. Vanessa McDowell. Tara Ann McLaughlin. Veronica Melendez, with distinction. Raven Mena. Elaine Mendez Jimenez. Melissa Mendez. Daisy Corema Mendez Rezinos. Adriana Marante. Sabrina Merlino. With distinction. Kenneth C. Merritt. Jessica Mixus. Emma Mursky, with distinction. Jennifer Curry Mohammed. Mia Montes, with distinction. Robert Mooney. Samantha Morano. Brianna Kelly Morgo, with distinction. Shyla R. Mosa. Maureen Mott. Diamond E. Mullings. Terrence Murchie, with distinction. Kathleen C. Murray. Anthony P. Naclario. Shamsun Nahar, with distinction. Adamar Nater Ocasio. Amanda Nigro.
Sophie A. Novak. Christine Marie O'Connell, with distinction. Joanne O'Grady. Judith Pagan. Nelita Pagan, with distinction. Michael Robert Pagliaro. Chitra M. Paniker. Nina S. Panki. Mendisa Parchment. Jeffrey Park. Patria P. Paris. With distinction. Brittany Passarello. With distinction. Galena Pavel. With distinction. Damaris Pearson. Lisa Penta. Caceres Natalie Peralta. With distinction. Rachel Francelina Pereira. Alexander Perez. Amanda R. Perez. Kiana Perez. Yanira T. Perez. Lauren Pesci, with distinction. Gloria Finsey. Nicole J. Piacente, with distinction. Kilia D. Peer. Miley Ann Pickle, with distinction. Shaylee N. Pimentel. Maria A. Placido, with distinction. Mary Jacina Polanco. Dinah J. Poland. Marino Y. Polito, with distinction. Mark Paneros. Michelle Portillo. Victoria Prashad. Tyler P. Prosha. Andrea L. Pucarelli. Ayana Punter. Carla Lynn Purcell. Madeline I. Quezada. Lynette A. Quiles, with distinction. Yesenia Quintero, with distinction. Perhad Razak. Christine Marie Reich. Martin S. Resendiz. Tara M. Roby, with distinction. Annie Rodriguez. Christina Rodriguez. Flavia J. Rodriguez. Janet Rodriguez, with distinction. Jasmine Rodriguez, with distinction. Jessica Rodriguez, with distinction. Yadira Rodriguez, with distinction. Gianna Phyllis Rossi. Brittany M. Roth. Jenna Russo, with distinction. Thomas Saladino, with distinction. Samantha T. Salaturo. Ashley Marie Sanchez. Francisco A. Sandoval. 
Maria V. Sawyer. Anna Scaramella. Carolina E. Shamulian. With distinction. Heather Schrader Rank Barrett. With distinction. Julie C. Seda. Shia Shane. Jerry Ann Sheehan. Laura R. Shepard. Ali B. Sina. Rena Sinanaj. Gagandeep Singh. With distinction. Renee Slater. With distinction. Allison E. Spedaleri. Danielle Stolick Claiborne. Erica E. Suchuai. Dana Tate. Peggy Tarantino. Patricia M. Tavera. Stephanie Tanya Teets. Esther Tarabello. With distinction. Michelle Suzanne Thomas. Elizabeth M. Thomopoulos. With distinction. Calvia Teneo. Jason M. Torres. Yanaira Torres. With distinction. Chris Totten. Christopher M. Triantafillo. With distinction. Stella Tsimas. Ariane Morena Tulloch, with distinction. Jillian Elise Ubides Gonzalez, with distinction. Justin Uliano. Jade C. Unman, with distinction. Angelica Concepcion Ureña. Robert Valenti. Maritza C. Velasco. Kenya Velasquez. Catalina Velez Calabro. With distinction. Andrea Villavicencio Hayward. Amanda L. Vrisima. With distinction. Malka Wagner. Jessica Ann Walker. Denisha Warfield Dawson. Lindsay A. Warner. Coral Lemuel White. Kim M. Williams. Samia Renee D. Williams. Sean Xavier Williams, with distinction. Nicola Wilson. Rebecca Q. Withers. Patrice Y. Woods. Elizabeth Yaport Kennard. Stephanie A. Zant. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the graduating class of 2021. Please join me in congratulating our graduates.